Bayek, what good fortune! I thought it would be years before we saw you again. Hail in peace, Menahet. How is your family? <laughs> the children seem to grow larger by the minute. My wife and I have our hands full. And you? Is there any news of... None. I forget myself. There are so many things in your life best not spoken of. Forgive me. I see by your garb that you have been promoted. Ah, yes. The High Priest, in his grace, made me his second. And my rank is not the only thing he has changed. You must see the temple. You will give me a tour? Of course, of course. At the moment of your pleasure. Ready to see our beautiful temple? After you, Menehet. Or is it servant of the goddess? Menehet will do, for one as good as family. This is far from the sorry ruin of my last visit. Yamu now plays constant host to ceremonies showing our rustic way of life. Which attract many visitors with more gold than sense. Uh, a description well suited to Alexandrians. How does this sit with your faith? I confess that my thoughts are sometimes uneasy. Why have you left your mother's side? Pick me up, Uncle Bayek! Ah, see now, there's no need to attack a man from behind when I'm numbering him four to one. Huh? You taught us to secure every advantage possible over a tender's foe. Yes, yes, yes. And I am very dangerous! <laughs> Hide well, for the wanderer stalks your path! What with the gods are you doing down there? I wanted to hide, but now I can't get back out. I'm scared. Stay calm. I will help you out of there. Straight home to your mother. She will be worried. Come away from there, Nyla. 
You're getting in the priest's way. Following me. You might get lost without me. It's a big temple. <gasps> Beast, you may meet your end at the hands of the mighty gladiator Sorry. <laughs> Your father wants you to go home. And I prefer to stay with you. Free up heads. Asina, you must come down from here. This would be a good place to watch the stars. Only the priests are permitted here. You know that. Yes, but I want to see... Hush. Come down now. We can watch stars from the riverbank. That's the last of the children. I will tell Menehet that the children are safe. On a chair. Look at this. Fraud abounds in your market. And you claim you can do nothing? The dealings of the market are beyond me. Speak rather to the offending merchant. <laughs> Priest! You have proven as false as your mummies. Men ahead. Your brood is delivered safely home. Thank you, friend. Hey, what did that fool want with you? Some visitors, having purchased religious objects, are angry when our village has no more dead cats to sell them. Though not a merchant, I am often the means by which the aggrieved snuff their anger. This matter needs a firm hand. Give me your aid! I order you! Magi, help me, I will pay you! What do you need? Last night, my dear husband Claudius took a boat out to see the ruins across the lake. He has not returned. None of these brutes honor a wife's pain. I beg you! I will seek him out. Do be quick! I will await you here.
Get no more food from me. And here is Claudius. I... Did you? Crocodile can talk? Always something new. Thank you. 
crocodiles are dead. Now to speak to Claudius and find out why he came out here. Why did you kill them? We had only just met. Claudius, you are drunk. Yes, that is me. And no, I am not. I had only two or ten beers. All right. Let's get you back to your wife. I have a wife? Oh, mother will be so pleased. What is your reason for going out there, Gladius? I was going... I was going... Remember, I came from Alexandria for the festival, and some kind of... Someone offered me to drink all night for free. Impossible to re resist. What were we talking about? How you got here. Oh! Right, then I woke up here with those crocodili all around. Tell me, can they really speak? Egypt is a land full of magic and ancient mystery. Amazing. My friends in the city will never believe. Did you say something about life? Uh, yes, yours. See, I do not understand that. How could I have a wife? I am a virgin. At least I think. There you are, my dear. I was worried about you. Oh, my dear Nisus, I remember. I went to the island because of her. She, she got me drunk, married me, told me I owed her a virginity tax. Whose virginity? You can go. This is between me and my husband. No, 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 don't, don't go. They'll kill me. Show him what happens when you frighten cheat a woman. Please, help me. Forget him. He's just an idiot, Greek. They have taken enough from our own. Yes, that is right. Taste your own blood. Mercy! Mercy! Your tax collectors never listened when we begged for mercy. Go on, hit him harder. Why do you let them do this? My brothers! You have slain my brothers! Grace. And you thanks. were supposed to help you me, saved my not life. him! And my purse. In future, be careful when drinking with strangers. like a child made it. These cat mummies are false. You 
You sold me an amulet of Hathor and my wife got sick anyway. Why, there's nothing but straw in here. Greetings. I am... You have come to the right place, Ned. We have everything you could possibly want. What I want is to ask about false idols sold at the market. I have heard rumors of such, but there is nothing to them. Now leave if you want to avoid trouble. These cat mummies are false! <laughs> My sister told me she bought us. Tell me of the fake mummies being sold here. I have no desire to be dragged into this. Menahet sent me. Your silence is an insult to his holy office. Yeah, I wish to anger neither him nor the gods. We are forced to sell items of lesser quality. Or see our stalls destroyed. Who is behind this? I can say no more now. Let us meet tonight, where the village turns to farmland. Better return at night, when we can speak freely. Just stay sharp, then.
to be sure. Here is the Book of the Dead. Becca will be pleased. Now to return the book to the old man. Is it stealing if you rob a thief? I do it for my father! Has your father left us? His good life is over. He was too weak to live till you return. May he be conducted in peace. He was in despair that his cow would not join my mother's. Where is his body? It is not too late. You are a blessing from the gods. 
he receives the rites in this small temple. you to your wife's side.
gods help me. I am coming for you, Aya. I should be cautious around here.
My friend, I am glad to see you have kept our appointment. Come, sit with me and share a drink of wine. I do not have time for that. <sighs> it is a beautiful night. Let us enjoy the coolness of the air for a moment before turning to business. Merchant, I am not here to take in the air. Who is behind the traffic of false icons? Well, you see, it is no simple story. There are many involved in this terrible affair, but they would all tell you the same thing. Pity the trusting man, for he suffers great pain. Seek evil, and you will always find it. Eat shit, Magi scum. Sailing unknown waters always brings the risk of shipwreck. A man who fights as well as you can perhaps afford to be trusting. Talk, or you will meet the same fate as your friends. That will not be necessary. Among the dunes, southeast of here, is the bandit camp where the fake mummies are made. I suppose you would go and destroy it now. Better I smash the camp than your head. Destroying these forgeries will earn the favor of the gods. As Ra lives, what a disgrace. Hang on. This place is heavily guarded.
your problem. Get out of here.
Ah, here you are. I've dealt with the trafficking of false mummies. Thank you. <laughs> How can I ease the burdens of an old friend? Tonight, we will stage a grand spectacle. Our goddess Sekhmet defends the people against Ispet's chaos. But Pamu, our champion, is nowhere to be found. The High Priest will judge me responsible for his absence. I'll have a look. Sakhmet bless you. His home is near the market, but check the tavern first. It pains me to ask you for a further favor. Hamu does like a drink now and again. <laughs> 